In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to view iCal in Google Calendar. Imagine you've got a calendar full of important events saved in an iCal format and you want to make sure you can access these events alongside your daily schedules on Google Calendar. Well, you're in luck. Today, I'll walk you through the simple process of adding an iCal calendar to your Google Calendar. It's easy, it's quick, and once you get the hang of it, you'll be able to manage all your events from one place. First, let's get you signed into your Google account. Head over to Google Calendar by entering calendar.google.com in your web browser. You'll be prompted to sign in, so go ahead and type in your email and password, then hit next. If you're already logged into your Google account, you might skip this step and go directly to your calendar. Once you're in, you'll notice your current calendar view, but what we're interested in for now is adding a new calendar. Look towards the bottom left of the screen and you'll see a small plus plus icon right next to other calendars. Clicking this opens a menu that leads us to our next step. From here you're going to select from URL. This option is exactly what we need because iCal calendars are shared through URLs. Clicking on from URL will bring up a new screen where you're prompted to enter the URL of your iCal. Now this is where you'll need your iCal link. It's usually provided by the service or the calendar's creator. Paste this URL into the designated field after you've entered your iCal URL. All that's left to do is click on add calendar. It might take a moment, but Google will then begin to import events from the provided iCal link into your Google Calendar. This process is mostly hands off, but depending on the number of events, it could take a few minutes. And there you have it. Once Google finishes importing those events, you'll see them appear within your Google Calendar. It's as simple as that. By following these steps, you've effectively merged your external calendar events into your Google Calendar, ensuring you won't miss a beat across all your schedules. Um, a couple of tips before I let you go. If you ever need to update the iCal events, depending on the source, it may automatically sync. However, some calendars might require you to manually refresh or re-add the URL for the updates to show. Also, remember that you can rename, change the color, or adjust the settings of your newly added calendar for better organization and visibility. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more helpful guides and tips. Stay organized, and see you in the next video.